few groups I want to discuss. Uh, first one is I'm going to start this Google group, uh, basically for Philippines. Um, I'm going to do another one, another one for Spain as well, but for some more engagement, because I know we have these comments that are literally about these videos, uh, we could expand it out, and I'll be honest with you, I'm, I'm a pretty brutal moderator in some sense. Um, I like to things to stay on topic. So if somebody's talking about goat rearing, I don't expect people to put their love life on there. <laughs> I'm not. It's... I'm very critical like that. I deal with companies where they go off on a tangent and I know my videos go off on a tangent but you hear me slap myself and put myself back where I should be. Um, as such, I like things to be that way. But at the same time, I want the group to be for everybody. Um, as such, if other people want to get involved, then get involved because at the end of the day, it's not about me, it's about us, as as a people, as as a community, and as long as nobody's upsetting anybody else, I can't see there being a real issue. I want to say upsetting, I, I, I don't mean like um, somebody disliking somebody's post, I'm talking about people actually personally attacking somebody. Um, for example, if somebody posted, oh, this is how I reared my goats, or whatever, and you turn around and say, well, that's absolute rubbish, um, that's I don't believe you did that. Can you prove it? That's fair enough because you're actually questioning whether they were telling the truth or not, which for me is logical. It's why like my troll, if somebody actually said to me, "Well, make a YouTube video then with all of this information you have," and it would all just fizzle out because it's all fake. Um, so there's going to be a group, I'm going to put it here, it's going to be the Philippines Expat group on Google. I'm going with Google instead of Facebook. Um, I've got to admit, I'm finding Facebook hogs too many resources. Um, from an IT point of view, I find it's overloading my, my uh, phone and Firefox. As such, I'll go with Google, it's a bit lighter, or seems to be at least, until we start using it, it may be exactly the same, <laughs> but we'll go with Google. Um, now, there's another group I'm going to share, which is Philippine Scammers. Um, this is a group that's been run by somebody else I know. Um, it's nothing to do with me. It's just that you may find the topics interesting. Um, there is the discussion relating to Phil Prince's incident and uh, Filipino pride, which is something I'm not touching on, but... If you know where I was coming from with what I was discussing about mannerisms, etc., you'll understand fully, or you won't, which is why I'm not, <laughs> I'm not getting on that one. It's um, quite simply, you either get it or you don't get it. It's simple as that. But it, things like that are going to be in that Philippine scammers group. When I say Philippine scammers, it's not people actually scamming. It's people warning you of scams that are currently ongoing. Um, and also things to be aware of. So it's quite a useful group. Um, and like I said, I'll set up another one for Spain because I know there's a few expats that are looking to come to Spain from the Philippines, but also there's a lot of people out of the UK that are sick of the UK system because the UK is very expensive to live there these days. Um, I myself, I couldn't have sat on my backside for the last, what, four months? If I was in the UK, it would already have eaten my uh, money in the bank. I find my cost of living in Spain is about half. Uh, cost of living in the Philippines is about the same as Spain because I have kids, because I have to pay for private education. In S Spain, I have to pay Social Security. And I'll do another video on Social Security because I've just had something done with my self-employment. Ha ha. Um... Yeah, there's a few things to update on Spain. I haven't done it recently because mañana, mañana. <laughs> we've had Christmas, we've had the Three Kings, and we've had the fact that things take forever anyway. So I've had things that should have taken 15 to 30 days take two months. All right, thanks for watching. Yeah.